Well, a dry weather watch remains in effect in the east, and a dry weather advisory has been issued for Seoul as well. So be sure to be extra cautious when handling fire and drink plenty of water to stay hydrated. And it's looking fairly bright outside across the much of the country, and the sun is boosting our chilly morning lows, which will transition to mild afternoon highs, getting up to temperatures similar to yesterday. So the daily high in Seoul will peak at 3 this afternoon, while Taegu and Gwangju will rise to 8 and 7, and Busan will be topping out at 10 under lots of sunshine. And as for the other regions, Jeju Island will be getting up to 10, while Jeju and Dukdo sees highs of 5 later in the day. Now, tomorrow should be the mildest of the month, with a high peaking at 5 here in the capital. But tomorrow night, mix of rain and snow will bring down the temperatures to a very cold size. So and they should remain freezing through the end of the week. So please keep that in mind. Uh, that's all for me today, and let's send it back to Hyunbyung in the studio.